What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Kieran here, and we are back for another Dirt Adventure video for the week of the 7th of August. Now, I honestly can't believe it's already August. Um, Zer is hidden over near the speaker this week, and he actually has some decent stuff, decent rolls, a um, couple of House of Wolves items, so let's go ahead and see what he has. There is one particular item that I'm pretty excited about for my PS4 character, um, but we'll get to that in a second. Yeah, I've, I had a pretty bad week on the PS4 this week. I uh, did the Nightfall and I got no backup plans with an awful, awful roll. Um, so, yeah, not a great week. Anyway, this is what Zer has got this week. And I'm actually, I'm not too disappointed. He has Eternal Warrior for the Titan. Uh, intellect at 56, Discipline at 75. So that is a pretty decent roll overall. Uh, we get more Super Energy from Non-Guardian Kills. Replenished Health when you pick up an Orb. And it will provide Unstoppable for Fist of Havoc. So, uh... Honestly, I've been running this on my Titan for the uh, the PS4 version, and uh, it's not too bad, actually. I actually quite like it. It's just the fact that it is really ugly, um, and uh, it doesn't change color with your shader. That's kind of a big big downfall of this uh, this armor set. Other than that, I think it is a pretty sound helmet. Um, it's not the best in the class, and um, that w would obviously have to go to uh, Helm of Saint-14, or uh, I think it's Insurmountable Skull Fort, but Eternal Warrior is a pretty good helmet. Um, if you have a Titan, go ahead and pick it up. For the Hunter, this is what I'm actually kind of excited about. We have the Bones of Ao. Um, discipline roll at 151. You can carry more ammo for heavy weapons. And this will upgrade double jump with an additional jump. Which basically means you can triple jump with a Blade Dancer, which is pretty fucking cool. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab these for my Hunter right now. Because I actually really need them. For the Warlock, we have the Void Fang Vestments with a strength roll of 159. That's not a bad roll, actually. What does mine currently have? Because, actually, uh, I already have these. I have 164, so I don't really need them, but, you know. It's just there. Also, I unlocked the... Uh, I finally got to rank 4 with Eris um, a few days ago. And I got the awesome Sunsetting Shader. And it looks absolutely baller as fuck with my Warlock. Um, I really like it. Anyway, Void Fang Vestments, we have Enhanced Axion Bolt, and you can spawn with Grenade, en grenade Energy. Uh, this will work with Sun Singers as well, so you can spawn in the Crucible with uh, Grenade Energy, which is really nice. Um, for the Axion Bolt, I believe it just gives you one extra little uh, little bolt that will seek out targets. Um, and you can carry more ammo for hand cannons and more ammo for special weapons. All in all, pretty damn good um, armor set. I, I use it quite a lot when I'm running Void Walker. Um, yeah, great great armor set, definitely pick it up. Uh, the weapon this week is the last word. It's been a while since he sold this, and I'm actually pretty damn glad he has uh, he's selling it, because I really need this on the PlayStation, because I don't have any good PvP weapons right now. So, uh, yeah, the last word is a very welcome, welcome addition. But, yeah, um, honestly, this gun, it's just, it's infamous at this point. Uh, there's, I think there's a bug currently where you can two-shot with it uh, whilst aiming down sights, which is fucking annoying. But I love this gun. It's ridiculously powerful. I actually really like this gun more than Thorn. Um, I can do a lot better with this gun. Um, the perks for this are hip fire. So this gun is really built around hip firing. You can do a lot more damage when you're you're hip firing. Uh, so we have hip fire, single point sling, high caliber rounds, and perfect balance. You're going to want to run perfect balance because uh, this gun does kick quite badly. And the uh, the exotic perk is the last word. It says bonus damage and stability, extra precision damage when firing from the hip. So as you can see, this gun is really based around sort of firing from the hip, um, which is fine because it's, it's really easy to do, to be honest. Um, but yeah, fantastic gun. If you haven't got the last word, guys, and you play a lot of PvP, pick it up. It's amazing. Uh, definitely, it's really not useful in PvE. Um, it's definitely a PvP. PvP gun. Um, this is pretty much useless in uh, outside of the Crucible. And the uh, engram this week is the uh, body armor engram, which I actually don't have enough mo uh, moats for, so I'm going to go ahead and grab some. There we go. I'll just get one, because there's no real armor set that I really want, but I'll get it anyway. And I need heavy ammo. From the nine. Just grab a few of these, because I need to get stocked up, because I'm running low. And uh, also, we have auto rifle telemetry, scout rifle telemetry, and hand cannon telemetry. So, if you want to level up those weapons faster, grab some of those. We have plasma drive, and we have stealth drive, uh, which will give you a red contrail, which is pretty damn cool. 
Um, that is it for Zer though this week, guys. All in all, pretty damn solid week. I am not disappointed in the least. And uh, everything actually has a pretty good roll. So uh, regardless of what you get, you're going to get pretty decent stats, I would say. Um, there's nothing there I, that I would immediately dismantle. So, uh, yeah, pretty good week. Let's go ahead and uh, go see this blue fucking arsehole over here. See, see what he gives me from this armor engram. If he gives me something with like an insane roll, then I'll be pretty happy. But there's nothing I really, really want. Um, well, that I can think of off the top of my head. Crest of Alpha Loop for the Titan. I think I already have one of these, but what's the roll on it? Eh, 145. You can't win them all, guys. You can't win them all. At least I got another shard. Anyway, that is it for Zer this week, guys. All in all, pretty good week. Definitely grab some stuff from him. Uh, I will see you in the next one. Take care, guys.